Okay, so now mommy will say hello, hello, welcome back to the channel. So this is more a sort of a, a vlog ready. So it is midnight, just about. And this little one probably won't be going to sleep until probably three, four in the morning. Because that is how it's been for, you know, the past few weeks. Um, obviously I have started work as um, on my uh, a previous video, I'd say, obviously, that uh, my maternity was finished and I was due to go back to work. Um, and obviously that started this week and it's been so hard. Um, I think I've counted in the past three days, I've slept... Uh, around six hours um so uh, yeah i'm quite surprised i'm still um standing but i think when you're a mom you just you know you find your strength anyway um so just obviously a little bit about being back at work it's been it's been good obviously it's hard because i've been obviously away from him but um i do have a you know a great a group of people um, around me at work and obviously that makes it easier um, and to be fair the first day when I returned home from work I was expecting him to be a bit more excited to see me than what he was all he wanted was that so I wasn't too happy about that um, but obviously it was just an amazing feeling to come back home and just hold him Although you can't really hold him for long because as, as you can see, this is, this is it. He never stops. So as I said, yeah, it's, it's about midnight. Um, he's been going to sleep 3, 4 in the morning. It, I have tried several things. It really doesn't matter if he stays up for 7, 8 hours straight. He, he can be really tired and yet he would not fall asleep. I'll take him up to the room, you know, and all he wants to do is just jump around. So he'll jump, jump over me, because um, at the moment um, he doesn't want to sleep in his bed. So he's sleeping with me. Hey, hey. He's sleeping with me, um, which I know is not um, ideal uh, for many reasons, but I can't keep him in his cot. Um, he doesn't want to stay there. Um, so it stays with me, which it is it, it is hard because he moves a lot. Even when he does fall asleep, he moves, he wakes up several times. Either he just wants his dummy, um, but you know, it just means that I'm really not sleeping properly um, for the two hours that I do get to sleep. So it has been, um, it's been a challenge. Obviously, it is uh, the middle of the week now, um, so I still got two more days to go, um, and obviously this will continue. Um, so I'll see how I feel um, on Friday, where I'm sure you know I will be shattered. He's fine, you know. He's absolutely fine. All he wants to do is giggle and play. You know, and this what he's doing now is what he does in bed. So sit here. No, 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 no. no. Sit down. Obviously, Scott is always with him. So um, yeah, it's been <laughs> it's been a tough one. Now, obviously, I think those are some of the perks of being a mom as well. You just have to deal with the, you know, I don't know if it's like sleep regression, whatever it is. I mean, I have read a few things. You know, obviously, there are, um, people who say there are programs you can buy, and you know, and they say, oh yeah, within three days he was sleeping. Um, you know perfectly a whole night's sleep and whatnot you know so I'm thinking I might actually get something because I can't you know be going through this for you know um, you know the weeks coming you know with being at work and all I do need my rest as well otherwise you know obviously it does kind of put a, 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 a. Hold on. just stay here look it's book here um, it obviously, you know, it takes, it's tough on me, obviously, so, I, you know, I feel fine, I don't, you know, I, do, I actually do feel fine, although I slept for six hours in the past three days, but, 
I know, I know that as the days go by, it will, it will be worse, and I do need my focus as well at work, so um, I will probably have a look at, you know, when these programs that everyone's talking about, um, so I just need to do a bit more research on it, and um, see exactly how, how good it is, and if it's worth it, um, but I, I, until then, um, this is our life now, yes, is it? So he's great now. So if it was like this, it would be fine, um, but he's a very um, active baby. I think it took my, definitely my side, because, you know, I do have, you know, as you can, a lot of energy still, even after not sleeping for, you know, um, all these days. Um, so, um, yeah, it's definitely a mama's boy in that aspect. Um, but just touching on, um, obviously, being back at work. Um, yeah, it's been good, you know, it, 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 it's good to, you know, be able to gain a bit of your independence, you know, so you just, you know, you're not just a mum, you know, you know, it's, it's about you as a woman as well, you know, so um, it is, it is quite important to have um, that time um, and it's great to come back, you know, at the end of the day and, and just be with him. So, yes, I mean, those... Those are the things that happen when, you know, obviously mums are working, so, yes, but it's good, yes, you miss mummy, yes, you tell everyone, yes, you do miss mummy when mummy's gone, yes, I wish you did say that, um, yes, so what are we going to do now, so now, I'll probably just, I'm going to stay with him, and I'll just, Try to not do much, you know, much craziness with him to see if he can relax a little bit and uh, just try to put him in a state where he will want to go to sleep. But it, it, to be fair, like I said, I have tried many things. I've tried reading to him, you know, giving him baths, even even at late hours, just to try and relax him a little bit. And to be fair, nothing really seems to um, to help. It's just how he's been. Um, try to keep him up as much as we could, you know, just to see if we get him tired in order to go to sleep. And it doesn't matter, he will, he can be really tired. And sometimes he does go off, um, you fall asleep for, you know, about an hour or, you know, max, you know, most of the time we're talking about, you know, half an hour, 45 minutes, and he will wake up and then he will stay up until 3, 4 in the morning. You're thinking, um, um, I'm saying, going to sleep maybe 10 o'clock, you know, then he wake up at a quarter to 11 or, or whatnot, something around those um, those times, and then he'll stay up. So yes, and it's really, it's really tough on mommy, yes, it is. Tell everyone, you're very, very rebel, yes? You're a very crazy baby. But mommy loves you very much, yes? So yes, everyone, um, so if you are in the same situation as me, I do feel, you know, feel for you, as I completely understand, you know, how this is hard. But I do, to be fair, at work, I have um, um, a colleague of mine, um, she's, um, she was pregnant at the same time as I was, and um, obviously she's not um, with us um, yet, but um, I heard that she's sleeping half hour here and there because um, her, her baby, her sleeping um, pattern is really, not the sleeping pattern itself, but just the sleeping in general, it just doesn't happen, it's like half an hour here, half an hour there. So I heard that she's really struggling. So I guess, you know, I can't really complain much about this one, although um, it's hard, but I'm sure there are worse out there, you know, so we just have to, embrace the situation and um, try and do whatever we can to make it a bit better um, and that's what we will do but for now we are going what to say bye bye to everyone yes we're going to say bye bye and what we're gonna do huh we're gonna try and go to sleep yeah you're gonna go to sleep so mommy can go to sleep so mommy can go to work as it happened today I was late so I went to sleep um, at around half five in the morning. My, obviously I had my alarm, but somehow I just 
I don't know if he, if he actually went off, I just didn't hear it. So I woke up with 10 past 8 when I'm due to work at um, half 8. <laughs> so um, obviously first thing I did was just um, contact my, um, my, uh, my line manager at work just to let him know that I'll be um, running a little bit late, which to be fair he was, um, he was quite um, good about it. She said, okay, I'll, I'll see you when you come in. So, um, yeah, I think I arrived at work just um, at 9 o'clock. Um, so, I just had to obviously make uh, my time up um, at the end of the day. So, instead of finishing at 5, I said till half 5. Um, which should be fair, it goes quite quick. Um, and yes, and so, and here we are, hopefully. Um, as Dad is home today, Mommy will try to go to sleep and Daddy can um, maybe stay with him even if it's um, for a little bit until he does fall asleep um, because mommy definitely doesn't want to go to sleep at half five in the morning again um, so yeah this is it this is what we wanted to tell people yes that you just not sleeping yes you don't sleep and you don't let mommy sleep you just want to play yes so now you're gonna say bye to everyone you're gonna say please subscribe to mommy yes and mommy will tell you more things about me yes very soon so say bye thank you subscribe to the channel put a like a comment if you relate to the story obviously um you can um tell me how it's going for you um is your baby the same um what have you done about it and um and so on so i look forward to it so yes thank you and take care i'll see you shortly